Hello everyone, in this video I will discuss about the screw thread terminology. So let's start. So the first part of the thread terminology is the crest. So what is the crest? It is the topmost point or surface of a thread. So a topmost point or surface of a thread is nothing but crest. Next is the root. So root, it is the bottom surface that join two sides of adjacent threads. So root is the bottom surface which is joining the two adjacent thread. So that is called as root. Next is the flank. So flank, it is the surface joining crest and root. So this is the crest and this is the root. The surface which join this is called as flank, which is also shown over here. Next is the thread angle. So thread angle means it is the included angle between the flanks of adjacent thread. So this is the thread angle. It is the included angle between the flanks. So which is 60 degree over here. Next is the thread depth. So thread depth, the perpendicular distance between the root and crest of the thread is nothing but the thread depth. So this is the perpendicular distance between the root and crest that is called as thread depth. Next, major diameter. So what is the major diameter here? So in case of external thread you can see over here and this is the internal thread. So in case of external thread it is the diameter of blank on which threads are cut. So it is the diameter of blank simply in case of external thread and in case of internal thread it is the largest diameter after threads are cut. So after cutting the thread the diameter largest diameter of the thread is nothing but major diameter in case of internal thread. Next is the minor diameter. So what is the minor diameter in both cases? For external thread, minor diameter is the smallest diameter after cutting the full thread. So here you can see the minor diameter is the smallest diameter after cutting the full thread. While in case of internal thread, it is the diameter of the hole drill for forming the thread. So in case of internal thread, it is nothing but it is the diameter of the hole of which thread are cut. So this is called minor diameter in case of internal thread. Next is the pitch. So pitch is nothing but it is the distance from a point on one thread. If you take a point on one thread, suppose this, to a corresponding point on an adjacent thread. So we'll take a corresponding point on an adjacent thread and we'll measure the distance parallel to axis. So we, we are measuring the distance parallel to this axis. So that is nothing but the pitch. So pitch is the distance from point on one thread to a corresponding point on an adjacent thread that is called as pitch of the thread. Next is the pitch diameter. So pitch diameter it is nothing but it is the this one which is the imaginary diameter. So it is the diameter of the thread at which thread thickness is equal to one half of the pitch. That is nothing but pitch diameter. Next is the helix angle. So what is the helix angle? So the angle of inclination of thread, okay, this angle of a thread to the imaginary 
perpendicular line which is drawn to the axis a line which is drawn perpendicular to this screw axis is nothing but helix angle so this angle is called as helix angle so the angle of inclination of thread this thread angle to imaginary line which is drawn perpendicular to the axis is called as helix angle so this is all about the th screw thread terminology hope you like this video thank you for watching